la 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 Hello everybody, so today I have finally updated my clickable mobs generator. This is one of my more requested generators to be updated. So it now has 1.9 support. It does not have 1.8 support sadly. All my future generators will only support 1.9 and they will basically they will only support the most recent full released version and the snapshots. So all my generators will now be 1.9 and 1.10 snapshots. When 1.10 comes out I'll drop the 1.9 support and so on. So, I've edited a few things to make it a little bit better. Now, instead of typing in the entity ID, it's in a list right here, and you no longer have to input an ID uh, yourself. So, I'm going to go ahead and make a zombie. Uh, NPC name is the name of the NPC. If you leave this blank, it will default to the entity ID. So, we can do Steve. Yep. Steve. Minimum distance from the NPC is how far away you have to be or the minimum distance you have to be away from the NPC for it to actually like run the commands. If you leave this blank it will default to 3 so you have to be within a range of 3 blocks. I'll leave it blank. Click event. This is the command that is run when you click it. So I'm going to do say hi and you can add commands. So let's go ahead and do say cool gen and say 3 and set block stone let's do three and these are run in the order that you type it so if we just click gen now this will create a command it's in a one command format so you just have to come into here and click always active there we go don't worry about the uh, sidebar that was something I was doing for a friend of mine for his server so you'll get a Steve NPC spawn egg. This will say whatever name that you have set to there. Again, it'll default to the entity ID if you leave it blank. And this impulse command block right here actually gives the spawn egg in case you want to spawn more or if you lose it. So I'm just going to go ahead and spawn it right there. So there is my, there is my Steve music and sound. I'm going to turn this down. So now... As you, <laughs> when I go up to him and I right click him, as you can see it says hi cool gen 3 and it sets a block above me. So I can do this again. I can come over and let's make a creeper and let's remove these and let's just do kill at P. Uh, now let's do say at P was killed by a creeper and let's do creep add command kill at p okay and now if we just click generate and copy this over to here paste it right there we can paste him down there he is he is creep and when we right click as you can see it says was killed by a creeper and it killed me so that's how this works. It's very simple to use, very simple to create your own custom NPCs now. I'll probably be using this a lot in uh, some future projects that I'm working on. But yeah, so have fun with the generator, and goodbye. They say that life's too short to waste time. I don't know if it's the truth I heard it through the grapevine. So I'm a flash of smile, I have a great ride on the road to success while I'm closing my eyes.